Well, 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 well. Don't want nobody to worry about me. Well, 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 well. Said he would make up my dying bed. I guess he did. Said he would make up my dying bed. Well, 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 well. Don't want nobody to worry about me. Well, well, well. I can be driving down by the side of the road, there'd, there'd be this object, or else I, I have to climb into a bin, or it's quite often the, the spontaneous of uh, uh, that decision to actually see something and, and be able to make something out of it, rather than having an idea and, and, and then finding the materials. You know, the materials actually come first. Now you've got to have that great strength of commitment and faith within what you're doing to achieve the object and uh, sometimes you get lost. Are there any particular, uh, I guess, pieces that uh, you feel most proud of or that uh, you feel have spoken most about you? Is there something, uh, the nest for example? People respond really well to the nest, and, which is nice, they seem to understand what they're about without me really telling them, which is really nice. Mm. So they seem to understand that there's a lot of work and there's a lot of love and heart and soul in there. Mm. And the part that they probably don't know is that the love bird for me is about um, expressing the, um, the spirit or the soul of a person that, that you don't see when you first meet them, but it's something that's much bigger than they are. Mm. And so the love bird is about that, that soul being made visible. And so you see that through my work and paintings and about having performed here is the fact that it's our home where we perform now, where we practice and rehearse, and we felt so welcomed here by you, so thanks for that, I really, oh, really? appreciate That's it. Really good. And the fact that you're into it and, you know, supporting us. Oh, really, I was totally into it, it sounded amazing. It was really, really great for us. And yeah. they were nervous? They were, but they relaxed as soon as they saw the crowd looking at yeah, them and enjoying yeah, it and, yeah, yeah. you know, had a fantastic time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it looked like they got a bit of a high, I was talking to a few of them just then after oh, the gig yeah. because it was amazing I stood behind you and I could see the audience just, it was, it was great. And everybody responded to the call and response part of clapping and, yeah. you know, so the audience was into it. Yeah. Really, you know, appreciate that. Yeah, yeah. that was awesome. Thank you. Thank you. So much. For Thank you. I really appreciate it. Mm. You're a darling. You are. And I love your voice. It's amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, big thank you to Mark Howie, Sarah Katina and Michael Jenkins. Uh, without the artists, we wouldn't have a show. Uh, they inspire and they've much to, there's much to admire. Hope you can come on down sometime. We'll be running for another three to four weeks. Hope to see you here soon.